How's it going, everyone? This has been a huge request on my live stream. Everyone's always like, oh, play Cookie Run. All right, all right, all right. We have Cookie Run Kingdom. They're actually sponsoring this whole video. So huge shout out to them. Make sure to download the game in the link description down below. It's available on iOS. It's available on Android. Check it out. Huge support to the channel. Guaranteed you're gonna love it. I love it so much. Latte cookie just came out. Oh, yes. I'm so excited. I have so many resources. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to unlock latte cookie in the gacha. I've been banking up so many diamonds and everything for this very moment. Got the daily reward. By the way, I have a cookie run kingdom channel. It's called more juice. Check it out in the link in the description down below. I talk about which of these values are the best deals and the crystal monthlies are really good if you log on every day. I actually just leveled up Look at that. Cookie Castle 11. So it's an RPG gameplay where you can base build and everything else. Literally all of these different themes have different decorations in them. First things first, I'm in dark mode right now. I already beat the story because I'm amazing. This is the party that I've been using to farm. Dark Choco, Licorice, and Espresso. But word on the street is that Latte completely replaces Licorice. And it's just a full burst meta right now. I've got 170k damage. It's a real-time RPG. I'm going to use my dark licorice lower their defense i don't even need to really worry about it don't even need that espresso for that full burst and check this out this is my favorite part of the stage for 523 it's cookie run double jump get all the cookies oh yes yes slide <laughs> i like pomegranate cookie because she gives she heals and buffs your entire party with 20% attack. I've got cheesebird coin purse because I'm I'm just farming right now. Licorice cookie summons those little summon thingies. Oh, those things, they die too fast. And that's me trying to farm soul stones for sparkling cookie because it's a full on RPG where you can level everyone up. And sparkling cookie right here. I just need four more soul stones from sparkling cookie. And here's why. Bonds. If I can get all these cookies to one star, sparkling is the last one behind. If I get one star, it's going to be plus 250 HP and 30 attack for everyone in my party. I might have already maxed out espresso cookie because um, she's double S tier. We're going to kick it back, relax, collect all of these. Ban my storage? Yes, please. It's interesting because to get some sugar cubes, they're all the same price. But this is going to give you the sugar cubes the fastest. But if you're going to be sleeping, I like to queue up the cart. There was a time when root beer costed milk, and that was a lot to make. I'm so glad the devs changed the update. They balanced the economy, and it's a lot easier to get milk now. I'm so happy. Shiny glass used to take a lot of resources, too. Now it's a lot easier to come by. I'm so happy that they changed the economy. So I got toffee jam and the tree of wishes. You're just fulfilling it for these little cookies. Getting some little happy coins. Once you reach a certain level, I think it's like level 20 or so. You, you Gold is so easy to come by. You just come back to the wishes every 10 minutes. I literally just farmed 100k gold by fulfilling these wishes. Let's send off my cookies to come back with rewards in eight hours. And here's the best part. It's been a while. I haven't attempted dark mode stage seven yet. Let's see how that goes. Oh, I have my farming gear. I don't know if I can handle them right now. Ooh, yikes. That's a lot of damage. I might need latte cookie for this. Oh, uh, that's fine. Dark licorice is going to lower their defense. Use herb to heal up immediately. Immediately. Immediately licorice to summon stuff. Dark choco to lower their defenses. Espresso cookie needs to take out the back line like real quickie right now. Oh, jeez. I'm going to pre preemptively summon them. I'm going to heal up and... Give my team a attack buff. Espresso cookie for the CC. Dark espresso for the splashy splash and minus defense. <laughs> I never knew I, I would ever go full sweat on these cookies, but here I am. I've been playing this nonstop every single day. I love this game so much. Espresso cookie, come on. You got this. This is where we died last time. I'm just going to heal up my whole team. We're taking it easy. I'm just going to tank it and let them cool down. Licorice cookie preemptively summon. Pomegranate cookie for the buff. Espresso cookie after I activate Dark Choco for the debuff. Oh, come on. This is easy. I don't remember this being this easy. Yep, 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 yep. Easy. I was not sweating at all. Maybe a little bit. I've been saving up for Latte Cookie. 28k gems left. Let's see what the witch has. You can tell by your eyes. Oh! It's got the hearts. Yes. We're going to use this. I love how it just smashes the table. Let's bake that cookie dough. Who are we going to get? Oh, 
Two latte soul stones. I'll take it. Muscle cookie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. G give us the good cookies. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Give me latte. Hey, I can promo him to two star now. Wizard cookie. Oh, we got a lot of points for that. I like that. This one's going to be a rare one. Carrot cookie. All of these points. So you can check the probability too. Latte cookies 1.44%, whereas she's 0.152%. Obviously, the epic percentages are decreased while hers has increased a lot for this. 10 more. Let's go. Let's get this. Give me an epic. Ah, no epic. All right, we're skipping that. Got Clover Cookie, Latte Cookie. We're getting the Soul Stones from Latte. Lot of Latte epic Soul Stones. Here's the cookie. I think it's going to be a rare one. Cherry Cookie! Shout out to everyone that was there during the Cherry Cookie meta. Ginger Brave to push everyone back. Tiger Lily to stun. And Cherry Cookie to double stun. Oh, mid ladder was a nightmare. If your espresso cookie was level 50, you could have a level 10 Cherry Cookie. Just stun lock the whole team. That was a terrible meta. I'm glad Latte Cookie is here now. You know what? Let's open up four more. Okay, nothing. Latte Cookie Soul Stone. We have 10 Latte Cookie Soul Stones. I'll take that. At this point, we're just going to get the mercy from the Soul Stones. Okay. 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 One cookie roll. And we got an epic. No. It's not Latte. But for a one roll on Dark Choco, that is money. 0.08% to get to unlock that. That, that, was, that was good. I am lacking in treasures. I hear there's word on the street there's a new one. I could almost love there. I can level up my cheese bird. We need to level up my cooldown one, though. That's missing. The defense horn's really good. Even though it's not a, a rare one or a fancy one, the comments are really good in there. Squishy jelly. It's so OP. Cooldown. Elder pilgrim scroll. That's the one that we were missing. Sacred pomegranate branch. That's the one we were missing. Okay. Those are kind of rare to unlock those ones. I'm pretty happy about that. Okay, 37 cookies. Show me what you got. Rares. Rares. I'm just going to blast through all these until we get the good cookies. Not, yes, I could use Cherry Bomb Cookie. She's three away. One away from maxing out Pancake Cookie. Let's go. Normally, I would feel bad at because it's a common cookie. You don't want to waste your experience on any of the commons, but that doesn't mean you can't promo them. I'm one away from getting my Pancake Cookie to five star. My angel cookie is now five star. Let's promo him to five star. Celestial blessing be upon you. At least that's what I hope angel cookie's voice is like. <laughs> I'm literally one soul stone away from getting pancake cookie to five to unlock the bond. Plus 120 attack across all of my parties. That's huge. 27 cookies. We got this. Give me one pancake. Give me, give me a latte. Ah, no epics. Muscle cookie already right off the bat. Another cookie. And more muscle cookie, 120 points. Pancake cookie! That's what we needed! Who's this? Okay, we can level up cherry cookie. That's good. We're getting a lot of cookies on here. We got a rare one. Adventure cookie, that's the one we needed for the bond. Yes, yes. I can't believe it. We, we can promote pancake cookie. Let's go. Pancake cookie's so cute. I can fly really high now. Watch. Whoosh. <laughs> I don't know why they, they would have those voices. Look at that. We completed the bond. I want to fly. Plus 120 attack. Now, if you look at my party, they're at 171,000 attack power. They're at 169 before the bonds. Let's roll. We got seven more. I love me some gotchas. Finally, an epic. Oh, we're going to savor this dough rolling here. We're going to stamp it down, bake us some good dough, and it's going to give us the big boys. Look how sparkly that is. Give me some latte. Vampire cookie soul stuff. Mm, okay, so ginger brave more like ginger bad. Uh, actually, no, no, no. I take that back. He was a tier during the ginger brave tiger lily cherry bomb meta. That was weird. Custard cookie again. Yes. Show me the epic. Angel cookie. Here we go. Here's the epic. Latte cookie. Latte cookie. Bill Cookie's out of this meta. It's not a tank meta. You know what? OJ, be grateful. Be grateful. The tank meta will arrive soon. And when it shifts to tank meta, we will have a maxed out milk cookie. I remember when I got milk cookie for the first time, I was so excited. Let's check out Kingdom Arena. So the top players are using Dark Choco, Latte, Espresso, Herb, and Pomegranate. This is a 
full on burst damage meta. Number 11 is using Rye Cookie. Oh my goodness. I'm not ashamed that I hit Masters last season with uh, Tiger Lily Ginger Brave Cheese. <laughs> We'll be in master again for this season, 100%. We got to get that sweet, sweet reward. That limited reward. Y'all know how much I love the limited stuff. This total, complete, utter domination. Nobody beats OJ. At least not in this range. I have to push up a little bit. I've been lacking a little bit this season. Easy. Oh, 40,000 health? This is going to be taking candy from a baby. My espresso is going to one-shot them. All right, so here it is. Ginger Brave pushes them all back. Tiger Lily stuns the entire party because of how he pushes everyone back. Then I have Espresso Cookie just wiping the whole team there. That, that is how you play it. Five-star Espresso Cookie. For all of the pros out there, can you please tell me what I should put on my Espresso Cookie? I don't know if I should commit to min-maxing all of these with chocolates right now. I, I feel like I should swap to like raspberries for the plus attack for espresso cookie. Oh, we have five more. Okay. Nothing. Ginger, ginger brave. Two away. We just need latte cookie. Come give me latte cookie. <laughs> I want her so bad. I actually want her so bad. We're going to roll in the normal way. Maybe we'll get latte. That'd be so crazy if we got latte. Oh, mint cookie, 20 of that. Who this? Ninja cookie, okay. Three more rolls. I don't want avocado, come on. Who who eats avocado cookies? That's, that's whack. This is my last roll. Angel cookie, soul stone. Okay, well, at least I get mileage points. I'm triggered. We're rolling. Give me a, give me a latte cookie. At least I can star up a mill cookie. So we got that going for us. Get through all of these. I only want the latte. We're rolling for latte so hard. So, so hard. Are there any bonds for milk cookie? Oh, 300 HP, 30 defense. Heck yeah. I always thought milk cookie was thick, but it's just his clothing. It makes sense because he's tanky. So there we go. We got the bond for milk cookie. Plus 300 health, plus 30 defense. More latte cookie. Give me, give me them heart eyes. Stare at me like, yes, yes. Here's a rare one. Oh, these are so exciting. Over cookies, maxed out. Latte cookie, soul stone, no. Where do you maxed out muscle cookie? Fun fact about muscle cookie. If you get him to chop out a tree, he'll backhand the tree with an ax. I love these small details. That's why I love the devs so much. They, they look at the small details for this game. And no, it's not because they sponsored me, but yes, this video is sponsored. I love this game so much. Yeah. That's Kumiho. I was excited for a second. Three epics in one, one pull? The bitter taste of failure can be improved with a few drops. Uda, new phone. I've never seen this. I'm getting sh chills. Latte cookie is on a broom? Something on your mind? I can lend you an ear. <laughs> we, we unlocked another cookie? I, I get it. I just maxed out pancake cookie, but that's a lot of mouth. Another cookie? That's a rare princess cookie. Three soul stones. We unlocked seven cookies. Three of them were epics. Three of them were rares. What a crazy pull. And we got some soul stones from latte cookie. We're literally only five away from getting her to star one. Ooh, we're literally only five away. Why you got to do me like that? That's a decent deal. This isn't Canadian, so it's $26 Canadian. Expires in a day. Limit one per account. I need that those five soul stones. Oh, yeah. Oh, what? My werewolf cookie can be promoted? That's insane. I have been hoarding all of these cookie cutters and gems for like a month leading up to this very moment. So it does kind of make sense that I was going to roll her eventually. I've been saving for this video. Look at that. Star one latte cookie immediately after unlocking her. She's double S tier. Her silence ability, that's insane. I'm dumping all of my experience on her. Level 39, here we go. We're gonna max the heck out of her. Plus 68% outer damage, plus 51. Oh, dragon's low. Let's roll. How do we know if it's a good one? Oh, cream puff cookie can only be unlocked in the guild gacha. Is cream puff cookie good? Come join our guild. Orange juice, that again is orange juice. What level is my rye cookie? 
Level six. Oh, shoot. So there's this thing where we can deal 2 million damage with Rai Cookie. But my Rai Cookie is only level seven. I don't think I'm able to last hit, at least not with this party. We're just going to go in. It's going to be 200k damage. Maybe I'll make another video on that later on if I level up my Rai Cookie just a little teeny weeny little bit. He's got a certain attack pattern too, but right now I'm just... We're just going to wait a little bit. There, he, he, did, he did the head thing. Did the boom booms. Summon Licorice. Dark Choco. Everyone, everyone's stunned. I'm not, I'm not crying. You're crying. All right, Dark Choco has enough energy for one more. For the dragon. Ah, uh, I did hit the dragon. It's too far. 174, we don't talk about that. Latte Cookie over Vampire Cookie. Palm over Herb. I'll do Vampire over Licorice for now. Vampire, Rye Cookie, Tomato, Tomato, right? Right? I'm going to put this on auto and see how that goes because... I still, I've never used Latte Cookie yet. Come on, Rev Red Velvet Dragon. Da I see some damage. Not bad. Oh, those are the circles that we're looking at. Everyone's still alive. That was a lot of damage. Everyone got stunned. Espresso Cookie. Vampire Cookie's still alive. Oh, Palm almost got her heal off. That would have been so clutch. Espresso. Ooh. Vampire is still alive, though. That's pretty clutch. 150,000 more damage with Latte Cookie. Now, if I had Rye Cookie, man, I, I'm, I'm going to max her out. Let's farm some heal. It's a little bit different with Latte Cookie now. Oh, my goodness. Why are they all targeting Latte Cookie? I love how her spell is literally like a latte. Like, you see the flower art whenever she casts it? That last back thing over there is going to deal a lot of damage. Did she just throw an espresso bean? These little details. Oh, man. Palm to preemptively activate everything. Herb to heal because I know he's going to deal some big damage really soon. Latte cookie? I, I love you, latte cookie. The damage on this thing. Let's go. It's latte art on, on the floor. I used to be a barista, so these little details are so cool. That's Cookie Run Kingdom. If you haven't checked it out yet, Download it and link in the description down below for free. You have the kingdom builder with all these different resources to level up your cookies. You can roll for more cookies in the gacha with all the crystals that you get. There's a ton of crystals. And there's a really deep story that I didn't even touch on. If you look at the world map, there's all of these different things to reach the very end. Shout out to Kiki Run Kingdom for sponsoring this whole video. I love this game so much that I started a third channel just for this game. More juice. Check it out. Description down below. See y'all around.